all right everyone today that support and today i'm going to be showing you how to use 1.0.10 now with this i version um a month ago uh with mouse that free so in this video i'm showing you how to install iTop xp this problem uh after this after my show, you will be able to use this version on xp just like we're using on windows 7. so the first thing we need to do is to go and from there we get the steps because i have written there this site you open the browser okay once you open the browser you're gonna type itt dot is great dot org and then you click enter so once this site is open you can see it says information technology technicians free IT training first steps towards IT I have a lot of free stuff in there if you want to look at the home page but for this video I'm just going to be showing you what this video is about you have to go free lab management softwares once you click on it this will open up this page is just dedicated to teachers and technicians who are be using open source software like italc and other software where i'm going to be helping people out how to install them and troubleshoot them so you can see my first software is italc so you can go down and if you are doing installation for the first time and you want uh, you want a stable version of italc that will work on both windows 7 and xp then you should click on this video this is uh, everything in there that you need to know the new version 1.0.10 is the very fancy version the interface is pretty much pretty cool uh, it's much better than the last 1.09 uh, the bug was reported in XP or Windows SP3 uh, especially mouse freezes during our talk so whenever you install you will see that your mouse will freeze you will see a program running but then you can't do anything without mouse so what we're gonna do is what I did I made five steps so this is a temporary fix um, the author of this uh, uh, software he recognized this uh, problem and he's working on it and his statement is that he's gonna b fix this problem in next version but till then we have to use this one and to fix this I have made these steps so we're gonna go through all the steps here and then install install the software right on here and on XP to show you guys at work okay let's do the first step first step is if you have already installed iTalk uninstall everything related to iTalk this is very important you need to uh, uninstall everything so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna check if I already have it and I think so I do let's see um, right here iTalk and then what you do is uninstall on ital you click on it all right now you click on uninstall okay once it's finished you click on finish now you're not finished here you're gonna go to start then you're gonna go to your computer go to your C drive go to program file Once you go to program file, this folder, shift delete, shift delete and click yes. You might see this, you could not, could make some programs not work, just click yes. You will see this but just click ok and go inside. What you need to do is just get this shift delete and now I know this is one of the problem shift delete and you can see that some of the keys are are going from here delete delete okay all right so once you delete everything you come back to step two and when it says install click here I'm gonna make this live so you can click here or you can go back right here and download talk 
If you go to this page, click on continue. Then click on official build. Here you're going to click on the first link. Okay, make sure you save it somewhere. So I'm going to save it on my desktop. Okay, during the installation, I might get some problems in there because sometimes this program, it needs to be if it, if you have if you already install iTalk on your computer, you need to delete every single thing. Um, check your taskbar. If you see a little green icon in there, even after uh, deleting the software, uh, it, it, you might still have some problems in there. So what we're gonna do? Done. Close this and. And what we're going to do, we're going to go back to our site, which is itt.isgreat.org. Then go back to free IT courses, and then here, free lab management software. And just open the steps area, just make sure it's in front of you now what is the third step it's asking us no second step sorry installed and click here okay so we already have this right here this is uh, our installation on our desktop you double click on it click run you're gonna see this click next click I agree and click you in now with this installation, I'm I'm definitely gonna have this problem with my mouse freeze. So uh, my video, I'm gonna try to save this video, and then come back with a fixed video, and I'll show you how to fix that too. So you're gonna be doing the same thing, and only you're gonna go through it. So just click next, install. Now if you didn't delete your uh, your client you will get errors like your your client uh, is not found and stuff like that so you make sure you delete everything before you do this step